Jessica, and we'll try to answer some of those questions with the help of some of the state's top doctors. You know, this excitement over the arrival of the vaccine in Washington is really tempered by the reality that this pandemic will have a grip on us likely for several more months. Another group of frontline medical workers received their first doses of the coronavirus vaccine. Swedish Medical Center provided these pictures Tuesday night and would not allow journalists to capture the historic event. As encouraging as it is to finally see a vaccine in Washington, doctors are urging people to not let their guards down. A panel of experts brought together by the State Department of Health answered some of the most pressing questions. When will we go back to normal? Until we get a larger percentage of the population vaccinated, we still have to, you know, take all the precautions we're taking currently. Maybe by the fall is kind of what I'm saying. Maybe fall, winter, it'll feel a little bit more normal. Um, but I don't know that we'll ever get back to totally pre-pandemic life entirely. Doctors say they know the vaccine is highly effective at preventing you from getting sick, but they don't yet know if it prevents you from transmitting the virus to others. When will most adults be vaccinated? I think there's a decent chance that most adults will get, you know, vaccinated by June. When will kids be back in schools? I think that we have a really good chance and expect that um, come fall, um, we should every the teacher should be immunized and the kids should be immunized and we could have that back to normal. Um, and I think that's the realistic goal. All of the doctors on the panel say they plan to roll up their sleeves and get the vaccine as soon as possible. Swedish says it will start vaccinating the public starting tomorrow, but those doses are reserved for the most at risk patients. They're for caregivers and also first responders. Live in Seattle, Ted Land, King 5 News.